what extraction pattern? Give me one extraction pattern in class three. What do we take out in the top uh, for class two? What do we take out in the lower right now? So you take out four. This is a common one to take out. So you can then recycline these guys more. All right. Any other extraction pattern you can think of? A single incisor. Okay. So a single incisor is sometimes an option, and it's a, a method in which you can try and get your 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 um, your bite sorted out. Now, do not going to ask you a question based on the single extraction. Okay. You're going to answer me. If you take out a lower incisor, what's the chemical reaction going to be? What did I tell you in the beginning of the whole game? Mm -hmm. What are you planning on doing with your kin relations? Keep you keep them in class one. Yeah. You keep them in class one, everything is going to be okay. Yeah. You start moving your kin relations. So if you start, if you take out this guy, your kin relations is going to go forward ever so slightly. Like you said, it's going to start going three. Now what happens to this guy? He moves forward. Mm -hmm. and you understand? And he never goes perfectly, completely into a full unit. Mm -hmm. So what will happen now? You will start getting clashes. You'll get wear, you'll get, uh, uh, what's it called, uneven contacts, you understand? And all that sort of stuff. So the aim of the game is, if you take out a lower incisor, mm -hmm. what have you instituted? You've instituted a Bolton's discrepancy, you understand? Yeah. So you basically caused a Bolton discrepancy. So now these class one canines, if you want to keep them there, and you take this guy out, and you close the gap, how will they close? Backwards. So what will happen then? You might get an overjet. You understand? No. You might tell me, but it's right here in class three. Why would we get an overjet? Exactly. The only reason to do this is because your bone is here. You understand? So when you retrocline, you're trying to get them as far back as possible into this position. Does it make sense? And you keep your canines in class? One. Now, if you start to close it, you're going to mess up your. You might get a better like overjet in some cases. Okay, you might, you might be able to procline if the case was a class one. Yeah. Okay, but the, the problem is what? When you start to push those teeth forward, you don't get any interferences and all these problems with the occlusion. Yeah. 